I got eyes in the sniper. Looks good. Come on, enemy activity, stay sharp. Sniper out there. This thumb drive's got video evidence that the cartel is smuggling children. We broadcast this shit while the Cardinal's giving the speech. Shit, they'll go from following him to calling for his blood. And he'll either leave with us or stay and get strung up. Hold up, we got hostile activity. Sniper. I have been thinking of that ruthless grin that has. If a tree falls in the woods, and no one is there to fall, did it make a sound? Of course. The drone is up. Yes, Spotted one with submachine guns. The tree hitting of it. See a second target. The branches snapping. Mark the target. Watch the background. That are sound. Even a target carrying no submachine guns. He makes five. Such a riddle will mystify children. The real question is... They got alarms rigged up. If a tree falls in the no one is there to be. No man in one can. And that is how it is with a man... Just spotted one with submachine guns. A man who lives alone in solitude. Be it in the wilderness or in his city of home. I got a target a carrying submachine guns. There's another one. That's ten. That car's got an alarm. He feels compassion for the homeless, for the widows, for the orphans of this world. All of his dreams Just spotted one with submachine guns. All of this compassion and waiting, this self-serving, this feeling, becomes nothing more than a security blanket that makes him feel like he's a good man. But he is not a good man, or even a bad man, because he may as well not be paranoid. Now, you're thinking, but, Bavari, I would do those things, fulfill my ambitions, help the poor, if I have the time. I have the money. Brothers and sisters, make the time. Make the money. With the blessing of Santa
got a Sicario. Tell me where. Close to the dump. Without any words other than the word that was written thousands of years ago. You got a tank with multiple civilians around. Brothers, when Santa Muerte visited among the people of Egypt, she passed by the houses of the faithful. She passed by those who demonstrated their faith in God by eating it on their doorways in lamb's blood. But those who did not believe, Santa Muerte and she took their firstborn sons from God. Brothers, Watch for civilians. We don't want to kill somebody by mistake. You will have your critics. You will have people who make up lies about you. But you can see for yourselves. You know from your own experience. You who venerate Santa Maria, that people envy and hate their success, but they do not understand. Santa Maria accepts everyone. Hermanos, hagan el tiempo. Generen el tiempo. 
Con la bendición de la Santa Muerte. Santa Blanca vino a... Got the alarms. Al paso de estos confesionarios. Esta organización ha hecho de este lugar su hogar. El hermano Sueño trajo muchas oportunidades a esta tierra y a su gente. ¿Cuántos entre ustedes le han vendido a Santa Blanca sus cosechas de hoja de boca? ¿Cuántos de ustedes manejan sus camionetas? ¿Cuántos de ustedes trabajan con sus proyectos? Este es el que será de Santa Blanca pone en marcha. Y el evidencia de que este crowd se convierte en un problema. ¿Cuá? ¿Cuánto comida a las familias que más lo necesitan? Ustedes son testigos de todo el bien que Santa Blanca ha hecho en Bolivia. Han sentido la voluntad y aprovechado las oportunidades que Santa Blanca les ha ofrecido. Stay there. Roger. Target's marked. Good to go. será recompensado. Hermanos, cuando Santa Muerte visitó a la gente en el antiguo día, ella dejó ir, sin ser tocado, a la gente que tenía marcada con sangre de corte. ¿Saben por qué? Porque demostraron su fe en Dios. Hermanos, ¿qué es eso? 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 Grab this asshole before the crowd gets him. The ult is escaping. <laughs> Shit, they spotted us. Those who are not so lucky are sent to work in the league. When other children are playing outside, these kids are labored on the moon, risking their lives. They'll kill me. In the name of God. God's got nothing to do with this cardinal. It's over. You want to get out of here in one piece, we're your only option. Understand? Yes. Yes, of course. Anything you say. Just get me out of here. You fuckers trying to lose me? Closing right. Let's go. Keep it moving, Padre. Padre? Don't you dare use that term of respect to patronize me. I give people a spiritual guidance. My congregation numbers are in the thousands. A congregation in a church bought and paid for by the cartel. I brought the congregation to Sueño. Because he's a true believer. He knows that I bring the true word of God. Isn't vanity one of the seven sins, Padre? I am no longer wasting my time talking to you. The lips of wisdom are closed, except to the ears of understanding. You are too small-minded to understand.
mausoleums look cute in comparison to the others. SB builds them for their Bruchonis. I've got a healthy enough ego to say I want something like this when I die. What are you, a seal? Because I don't know any quiet professionals who'd need something like this. Let's see what His Holiness has to say to Bowman. Get that quieto. Amigo, everything has changed because we broadcast that speech. Our priest has taken a vow of silence. You should actually read that when you're in prison. La conozco. No te apures. If a sinner chooses to worship at my church, if he chooses to pray with me, it is my duty to God to help the flock find its way. It does not make me a criminal. No. Money laundering makes you a criminal. Your church is built on a foundation of trafficking in white powder and kids. Usted no entiende. I felt horrible about those children. If that's true, then confess. Right here, with me. Absolve yourself of your sins. May God forgive me. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. The image was broken. The dream was crumbling. My church was dying out. Many of my men were leaving me. The campesinos were no longer afraid to slander my name. Those who hated me said I did all of this out of pride. The mausoleum, the websites, the Bible. They said I did it out of vanity. But if they could have seen it, if everyone could have seen my dream, they would have understood. I did it for them, for the sicarios. The farmers, the miners. I did it so they would dream of a better life for themselves. So they could envision how great they could become. How great they could make Santa Blanca, and how great Santa Blanca could make them. But when you get a glimpse behind the curtain, then you realize that the magic is nothing more than smoke and mirrors. And the glory which you once aspired to is nothing but a sham. We've received word from Pakatari that one of his rebels might have discovered El Sueño's location. Talk to the rebel and find out what he knows. Nomad. The activity thinks it's got a 20 on Special Agent Sandoval's body. Word is Sueño's people may be holding it until they can destroy all evidence of him. I need him, you understand? I have to bring him home. I owe him that. These cartel fucks have a way of making bodies disappear. You need to find him before that happens. Roger that, Bowman. We leave no man behind. <laughs>
is the RV. Something isn't right. Come on, move. Shit, I got a body here. It's that rebel leader Amaru. We freed that guy from the cartel. I'm trying to call Pac, but it isn't going through. Think Pac and his rebels threw down with the cartel? And Pac had to run? It doesn't look like there was much of a fight here. I'm calling Bowman. Maybe she's heard from Pac. Bowman, got a situation. You set up a meet with Pac and one of his guys. With Pac? Where are you? Listen. Instead of Pac, we found Amaru. He's been killed. Have you heard from Pakatari? Pakatari is here with me in Pukara. Bowman. Bowman. The hell is going on here? No idea. But we gotta get to Bowman. Fast. Never thought I'd hear myself say this about a CIA officer, but if they hurt her, I'll burn this whole fucking country down to get back at them. Right there with you, man. Bowman said Pac was with her. Then the call got cut off. Might be the sad phone dropped the call. Might be packed fucked us. Weaver, can you track Bowman's last known in Bukhara? Got it. Buckle up, people. Bowman. Pakatari. What about him? He turned on us. We were sent here as a diversion. Diversion from what? Sueño. The rebels found out where he is. Get to the mausoleum. I'll meet you there. Nomad? You understand what this means, right? 
From here on out, Pakatari and the Rebels are no longer our allies. Contact! Rebel Hostiles! Take it a shot. What are you trying to do? Same thing as you, amigo. Doing what's right for my country. El sueño will die on Bolivia's soil. My people must know. The government must know. The other cartels must know. The rebels are not slaves for the Americans. We are strong on our own. That why you killed Amaru? Because he wasn't strong enough. Amaru was a man of ideals. Brilliant ideals. But ideals do not feed people. Ideals do not build armies. Ideals do not take down corrupt governments. Neither does getting your people killed. My people know that if they die today, they will return tomorrow as thousands and thousands. That's not gonna make it any less painful. If there is one thing I've learned to embrace in this life, it's pain. A lesson I will soon teach to El Sueño. Now, unless you want to end up the same way, I suggest you leave Bolivia. Thank you for your help. Adios, camarada. Taking fire from cartel Sicarios. Fucking Una dead, too. Is there anybody in Bolivia who ain't. Hold up. Engaging. The lieutenant's trying to escape. Shit, they spotted us. Let's get back to business. Is there anybody in Bolivia who ain't shooting at us?
Chopper, down, down. We've got a problem, fucking Uni Dad's here. Moving. El enemigo ha retrocedido. Todas las unidades regresen a su patrullaje normal. Show us your fucking hands, now! I would, but unfortunately my hands are full at the moment. Where is he? I want to see the big bad heifer. Put it down. As you wish. Adios, Senor Katari. You have five seconds to get on your knees and interlace your fingers before I put a hollow point through your forehead. You're going to want to answer your phone, Officer Bowman. Hello? Sir? Yes. Yes, I, I don't understand. Sir... Sir, that is not possible. I am telling you that it's not... Please, I am asking you that you... Sir. Yes, I understand. Fuck! 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 Bowman? Fuck you! Fuck! Bowman, what is it? Bowman! He got full immunity. He got... He made a deal and he got... A deal with Fuck! who? Who do you think? The DOJ! Hold on. Hold on. You're not he saying... He offered up the heads of four other cartels, plus three terror groups that traffic heroin. His competition. How is this possible? As I told you, if you have power, everything else follows. Now, if you don't mind, Senora Bowman... 
It seems that yesterday you were my adversary. Today you are nothing but my chauffeur. Take me to your supervisors. I'm sorry. Bowman, no! <clears throat> The dream is dead. If you're watching this, that means I have executed El Sueño. I'm certain that people will think I went crazy. That I did it out of emotion, that I broke. Fuck them. They're wrong. I knew exactly what I was doing. This piece of shit, this monster, tortured my friend. Killed him. Decapitated my partner. Massacred thousands. He gets to walk? Uh, sorry, but not on my fucking watch. Given what El Sueño knew about Ricky Sandoval, he would have been unstoppable. Trivia question. What happens when you give immunity to a drug lord? Ding, ding, ding. You get a dictator. Taking out a drug lord is one thing, but stopping a dictator? You need a few more than four operators for that. My career, my freedom, my life is not worth more than the people of South America. Obviously, not everyone agrees. Which is why I'm most likely now in a federal correctional institute, getting three hots in a cot for the next 45 to life for murder. By now, CIA has probably released an official statement saying, the case officer in question is no longer employed by this agency and acted in direct opposition to her superiors. Her actions have caused great harm to the continued efforts of the intelligence community here and abroad. And guess what? They're right. I would have done the same thing as them. No hard feelings here. I just hope they don't leave Bolivia. Without Pakatari, the rebellion will tear itself apart with infighting. Unidad will make a deal with the next criminal organization that comes along. And the remains of Santa Blanca will split off and form new mini-cartels. All with shitty names like Nueva Frontera Cartel, Berrio Familia and Los Hijos del Sueño. Everyone will continue killing each other for that coca. I wonder, if God knew all the destruction that this little leaf would bring, would she have still created it? Or maybe that's exactly why she did. I don't even know anymore. But it's no longer my question to answer. So I leave you with this. In the dying words of Augustus, founder and first emperor of the Roman Empire, have I played the part well? Then applaud as I exit. Bowman out. Tienes la madre con todo. Vamos a enseñarles quién manda. ¡Ay! 
coming this way. What do you want us to do? Got an air defense system. somebody's cage. Drone is airborne. Escort has been destroyed. I think that's all of them. Got what we came for. Sending the location of the food truck to the rebels for pickup.
I'll drive. Hello, get down. I'm cool, let's move. <laughs> 